It's me. Kill this beat. <clears throat> I'm already on fire. <clears throat> Welcome back. It's you and me. We're going to play some Animal Crossing. Look at that. It's the male in the right. And look at that. It's my man in the left. <laughs> Welcome back. Let's see what we got for mail. From the museum. The far, far away museum cordially invites you to take part in the free fossil identification program. Send us any fossil you find and we'll identify it and return it promptly. My dear Hydra, well, just got back. We had a great time on our first trip abroad. There was one small hitch though. I woke up really late and I had to travel in my PJs. In a tizzy, your mom. Wow, why does she always have to make fun of my mom? Oh, we got some weeds. Take those out of there. It's been a... It's been a little bit since I played this. But the first vi first series of videos, it was a little bit since I played it too. Approximately 2003, baby. But you already know. We got a few things in mind. We're going to sell all our shells. We're going to get rid of all these gosh dang weeds. We're going to put our fossils back to the Fairway Museum. If we can keep our town looking clean, then it won't attract any unwanted attention, any unwanted visitors, any uh, murderers. All right, you understand? Ooh, I thought I just saw a sparkle. Uh, it must be my eyes deceiving me. So, I have just Hit that snooze button if you know what I'm saying. I, I slept for about 12 hours. <gasps> Nook's cranny is closed. How the heck are we gonna accomplish anything? It's gosh dang 4 a.m. boy. Okay, so we gotta put our thinking caps on, ladies and gentlemen, and start. Thinking <laughs> how the heck we're gonna accomplish anything in this in today's day and age freaking Millennials going to sleep early Is that how I don't think Millennials go to sleep early Well, I mean we can still you know, we can still send those fossils But we don't have any Any way of sending them because we got to buy it from the guy to dang Tom Nook Check it out, I dug up a Mega Puffoid. I said I didn't want unwanted attention. We got Mega Puffoids now. Cut this thing down. No, no, no. I'll buy your insects. I'll pay market price for any type of insect. That is... Not understandable. Mr. Thomas. No! 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 Alright, we're good. We keep it a hundred around here. All these screams are just half of the real anger I feel inside. When I don't get my gosh. You think this is a game? Do you think this is a mother freaking game? You think that all I do for a living is play video games? Well, you'd be damn right. Excuse me, Shirley Temple, what are you doing here? Good? Znerf? What? Oh. Hey, what the? Was I asleep here outside? If you saw I was sleeping, then why'd you touch me, you creep? Clucky? I'm just. This is what I mean. I'm in the rudest part of town. I'm hoping that I can make a name for myself. Because right now, people see me as the Midnight Creeper. I just go around and creep. Bah! <laughs> what is that even from? No. Well, I didn't mean to do that either, but it's hard to do it up, up, down, left, right, B, A. All right. Let's see what they got at the uh, at the old mill. <laughs> and by mill, I mean police station. Hey, Frogbert. Hey, you're Hydra, aren't you? Ribbit. I was just thinking about how I hadn't seen you lately. And here you are, out creeping in the middle. They, they all think I'm the Midnight Creeper. Well, did you get yourself involved in some dirty, shady business? No, Gribbit. You could have fooled me. 
Yeah, so, what did you want, Garibbit? You're looking to help me out, eh? Well, in that case, I need you to go out to Alfonso's place for me. I lent my glasses case to Alfonso some time ago, but now I need it back for... Personal reasons. What else? What reason do you need your glasses case for other than to put your glasses in? I don't know why that's so personal. So you get it for me. Sure thing, bucko. You've been officially asked, Garibbit. Alright, you weirdo staring at a tree. You'd think you were a tree toad. A tree toad frog! <laughs> get it? Alright. Enough with the jokes. You think I'm a comedian? That's not the case. Right? I'm a... I work the night shift. I'm a grave digger. Alright? And I got a grave with your name on it, Alfonso. Wait, now where, where is Alfonso's place? No. Ah, this is Alfonso's house. Sleeping now. Come back when I'm awake. Hey, how about you get with the times, old man? We hang out around 4 o'clock. Talking about 4 o'clock. So I napped from four about 4 o'clock p.m. You know, that's a, that's a fine time to nap if you plan on waking up at around, you know, like 6. Then go back to bed around 12 or 1, like a normal human being. No, I decided I'm going to sleep until 4 a.m. That's pretty good, right? Well, you live and you learn, Buster Brown. That's what, you know, that's what they always say. Back in the Charlie Brown days, they used to say, you live and you learn, Buster Brown. And then he'd be like, I'm not, who the hell is Buster? My name's Charlie. And they'd be like, oh, you're so funny, Buster. My pockets are full. No, just drop it, you weirdo. Stop picking up things. You're seen as a creeper. Lion's paw. Up, down, left, right. Welcome to the lion's paw. You know what? You're asleep. And you're, your neck's going to be hurting in the morning. I'm not even going to wake you up. I'm not even going to wake you up. Because I'm sick of being called the Midnight Creeper. Oh, I'm a Midnight Creeper, huh? I'm a Midnight Creeper, huh? It's a Minecraft joke. We are hitting the streets late at night here on... 105 frick a.m. 1.5 10 o'clock. Get wrecked, son. I'm out here defacing property with my shovel. I'm shovel night. Because it's night time. Also, this cop is not gonna like what he's about to see. Yep, now he just thinks I'm like. He thinks I need to go to a hospital. I assure you it's not the case. There's no hospital in mind for me. I just, I'm just out here digging up some goods in the middle of the night where no one can bother me. He's done it. Is what I would have said. And this is where my money would go if I had any. Oh no, I'm, I gotta bury something. But I want fossils. Um, bury this peach. That's not... It's not exactly what I had in mind. <laughs> um... Venus comb can leave my inventory. You can leave my inventory. You fickle beast of the night. Oh, uh, sure, yes. Every item here is lost. I mean, we don't know who owns them. The items. You could take anything, I think. Yo! We actually need this. Okay. Uh, eat this. Eat this! Heh! <laughs> nom, 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 nom. Thank you. That was a weird noise at the end. Nom, 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 nom. Well, that's ivy paper, I think. So I would be... Absolutely, I dropped... Paper. Yes, of course, you can take it, of course. That's fine. Go ahead. It shouldn't be a problem. I think. Thank you, Booker T. You were great in that game. Museum. Hello. You stinky. Moosum. That's 
Sure, that's fine. Fossil? Kiki. Do you love me? <laughs> Kiki. Do you that's that's a joke. It's a Drake thing. Um Please respond. There we go, boys. Hello, you sticky Muslim. Gotta be careful when I'm saying that. Muslim? Mus museum? Museum? Fossil, Kiki, do you love me? Please respond. Boom, baby. Slap that bad boy in there, just... I don't know how you're putting an entire fossil in a piece of paper, but it is a video game. Museum? That's it.